Leo, in this message, we were seeing how a friendship is evolving into a beautiful new beginning. Let's dive in and see what's next. Hello, everyone, and welcome in. Hope everyone is doing well. Positive healing vibes to all the subscribers, the viewers, and the world out there. Today, we're looking into Leo's weekly guidance message for February 21st through February 27th. And in this message, Leo, we are going to break down each day individually. We'll look at the cards as an overview. I'll clarify throughout the message. I'll pull a few cards at the end for advice guidance moving forward. If it's something you're interested in, you're more than welcome in joining us. Also, guys, if you like the vibe, how I interpret the cards, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Everyone's welcome, and it does help to set intentions for future messages. So, Leo, let's see what we can see for your upcoming energy. February 27th, 21st through the 27th. Please and thank you, Spirit. Leo, I feel like there is a new love offer that is coming in, maybe a friendship that is evolving into a romantic relationship, but I honestly feel here, Leo, that there is an energy of being closed off, okay? We're going to dive into each of these days individually, but I feel here, Leo, that you will eventually open up if that's what you truly want going to take a little bit of time and a little bit of effort, maybe un uncomfortable, but I do feel like you can open up a little bit to this new connection. So the first card we have here for Monday is the Ace of Cups. Please clarify the Ace of Cups for Leo's energy. This is that new love offer. I do feel like this is a person that's coming in. Now, this may not be exactly a person expressing to you that they want to have a romantic partnership. I feel, honestly, it's a subtle change. A subtle change that's happening between you and another person. We have earth energy. We have air energy coming out. Moon energy. I feel like there's some things that aren't being revealed in the present energy. You may feel like this is some secretive energy. You may be, this is, this may be what you're holding back, Leo. Okay. But I feel here, this is something you're also going to come to terms with. I, I do feel like you want to open up to this person. You just don't know how. Okay. Maybe you don't know where to start. Maybe you, um, you know, maybe it's how this person is, especially if they're queen of swords energy. This is a person who is very, serious, very matter-of-factly, probably doesn't express their emotions much themselves. Things are going to balance out, okay? I do feel like there is some uncomfortable energy that's going to be addressed here Thursday and Friday, but we will get to that. Justice energy always calls to organization, balance, okay? Readiness, being prepared. I do feel like you are getting prepared because you feel the shift happening, okay? You feel this change that's taking place here. I feel for some of you, you've been resisting this change for some time, but it's just naturally happening. Allow, let it flow. And how do you allow? How do you let it flow? Try to stay present. So one day at a time, one step at a time, right? When you're in the moment, in this present energy right now, you're focusing on what's how you're feeling right now, how your body's feeling, the things that you need to take care of day to day to get to that bigger picture goal, okay? 
the little habits, the little daily habits that add up, right? I do feel here also, Leo, if this does evolve into a romantic partnership, if that's resonating for you and that's what this energy is channeling, there's some things from your past, there's some things from this person's past that you guys are going to need to discuss. Now, maybe that's something that you guys have already confronted in the past, but I feel like that's not everything, right? There's some things that are still being hidden that you and this person may not be revealing in the present energy, and maybe it's how you truly feel about one another. This past energy is going to need to be addressed, whether this is with this person or individually by yourself. I feel like this is going to hold up this new beginning. Okay, this is, if this is an actual past person, they could come back in and sabotage. But if this is like past pain, resentment, loss that you haven't really processed subconsciously this will hinder your movement forward and guys to be honest with you i'm only speaking from personal experience i too have in the past have missed opportunities with people in my life because I wasn't ready or I was still holding on to something or someone from my past that was no longer serving me. And honestly, Leo, it may not be a person, but maybe it's like how a relationship ended. Okay. It's time to open up. It's time to open up, Leo, the two of swords. I do feel like you are kind of guarding your heart. I will say that protecting yourself from being hurt, but I do feel like you're coming to terms with a lot of things. Is this really serving me in the present energy? And maybe this is your person. Guys, for some of you, this could be your person that's holding on to something from their past, guarding their heart. I feel here they're starting to crack, okay? It, whoever is trying to protect their heart here they're starting to crack. Don't ever discredit this past hurt, this past pain. It was definitely difficult for you to get through that energy. It was difficult for your person if this is their per your person holding on to this past energy. So don't discredit that past feeling, that past hurt. Acknowledge it. Okay, it's there. But it's time to, to move forward. And acknowledging it is going to help make that transition. Okay. I feel here, Leo, by this weekend, there's going to be a conversation. Okay. You and your person are going to have a conversation where I feel here there's going to be some clarity. It's going to be brought in about how you guys feel about one another. Now, I will say... Maybe this isn't per se by the weekend exactly, but I feel like this is coming very soon. Okay. It's very soon. You, this person, one of you is going to start this conversation and it's going to open the door to start something new. Full energy. Now, with the full energy, there's always a take it slow, look before you leap. It's, it's new. So there's some naivety to it. But I do feel here this is a very intense connection and things are going to be turning in your favor very smoothly. Okay. Pool, Wheel of Fortune. Trust the process here, Leo, because I do feel like this is a beautiful connection. Okay. This is an intense connection and since it's evolved from a friendship, a little bit more than just love interest and I feel here a lot of you are in alignment with that a lot of you are just going to understand that let's pull a few cards out here for your advice guidance moving forward here Leo thank you guys again for all the love and support
Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all amazing. No extended version to the weeklies, guys. This is strictly for YouTube. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. If you find the message is helpful, resonating with your situation, please give it a thumbs up. Leo, Leo, Leo. Three of Wands. Take some time. Plan out how you would want to express yourself to this person. What exactly it is that you would want to say if you had this conversation. How do you envision this conversation going down? We see there is a deep connection here. There's a lot of love. I also feel here there is a friendship. So it's an energy of being a little bit more strategic, a little bit more careful. Trust the process here, Leo. Don't be nervous. Don't be scared. But I do feel there is a need to kind of be strategic. Don't be just don't spew your heart out to this person and tell them everything at one time. It may be overwhelming. A little, a little bit at a time, this person is going to understand. Okay? I do feel like you're headed in a positive direction. And this person is meant to be on your path for a specific reason. Okay? Trusting the process here, being a little bit open to this experience, acknowledging that there may be some fear here will help you to get over that hump. Your blessing message here, Leo, coming out for your reading is always do your best, love and nurture your body. Your own body is a manifestation of God and if you honor your body, everything will change for you. Practice giving love to every part of your body. This will plant seeds of love in your mind, and when they grow, you will love, honor, and respect your body immensely. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So, Leo, I feel like that's a good solid message coming out. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all amazing. And I look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon. Namaste.